you know, water can get into your fuel different ways. Sometimes it actually can go in when you're, you know, where you actually put the fuel in, whether it's a portable tank or whether it's a tank that's uh, built right into your boat. Sometimes it's from condensation. But the one thing that either does is it can really damage your engine's performance where you can't start it bog it down and create other problems. One of the products that I've been using for quite a few years is called K100. And if you do get water in there, it actually makes it burn, but it's also a stabilizer. And I've got Kevin Smith here from K100. Tell me how it stabilizes the fuel. Oh, okay. Well, thank you, uh, Edel. Let me show you how our K100 fuel treatment works. I'm gonna pour some regular ethanol fuel into this jar. And another thing about K100, you can use ethanol fuel. If you treat it with K100, that'll eliminate the harmful uh, effects that ethanol has on your engines. Okay. So that gas there, I'm gonna put a little bit of water in there. Yikes, I don't like water. If you're I know, together. none of us do. We're gonna put a little bit of water in there and hopefully you can see mm. that at the bottom of the tank. Yep, I can see it, it's cloudy. Yes. I'll take one of our competitor's products and I'll pour some in there. And to show mm, that, still see it. Even if you agitate it, still see that it. water is down at the bottom of the tank. Yep. Can I you see, see it, it clearly? Oh, yeah, I can see it. Okay. K100 because it's not petroleum based. It's an organic chemical. You pour that into our fuel. That will go down to the bottom of the tank. You will see a chemical reaction taking place it's immediately. Magic. That's not magic. It's chemistry. It's the yeah, organic. The cloudiness <laughs> is gone. Look at it. And it's, what it's done, it's gone through into that fuel and eliminated that water, encapsulated it with a permanent combustible shell and has put it back together with the fuel and repaired that damaged fuel. Amazing. You know, I would encourage any of you out there, whether you've had fuel that's been stored for years or months or from one season to the other, or you just wanna make sure your engine's gonna run properly, add K100 regularly. It's really smart.